All right, I wanted to get another video on Mr. Gator. Gator is here at the center. He's out and about with, a, uh, with the other cats, though he doesn't really like them. So we are looking for a home for him by himself. A very low stress home, um, no cats, dogs, kids. He's gonna be a lovely cat for somebody who's up for just a friendly, cross-eyed, um, interactive, chatty cat. He's not a good traveler, so I'd like to keep him close. Um, within a couple hours drive, he gets upset stomach um, from both ends when he travels, and we'll do what we can to minimize that, but I don't wanna send him super far away. Um, he is a four paw declaw cat, so while he uses a scratching post in the vertical position, he um, doesn't do any damage, but you should still have a scratching post for him. Um, he is suited for an adult household, a quiet home, routine, he loves his routine, he's very interactive and personable with his person. He actually is a cat that belonged to a gentleman um, in this last go around. He's had a couple of homes. Um, and so he's equally uh, man and woman oriented, which is nice. Um, he's a larger cat. He's not a cat you're going to pick up and lug around, but he's certainly a very friendly, interactive cat. He is going to um, follow you around and be interactive. A little bit of. Um, getting under feet, so nobody who's unsteady on their feet. Um, he's best suited for a middle-aged adult household, one or two people, that has a quiet routine, um, not a lot of activity, but certainly a working couple or individual is absolutely fine, and uh, would just like some companionship, some good solid companionship when they come home in the evenings. Um, a person or a couple who can pay good attention to litter box um, cleanliness, I think that's very important for this guy, and who doesn't mind that he's on a prescription diet, which he adores and loves, um, and we'll send plenty of that with you with him to get you started.